My name is Marco Bande, I'm an application engineering manager at Parker Hennepin, and I'm located here in Germany. Okay, obviously we're stood in front of a, something of a re revolutionary machine here. How did Parker become involved in the L128? Yes, it was uh, an easy question we received in November 2021. So Volvo contacted us and the question was, can you electrify one of our existing reloads? Can you replace the diesel engine and have a kind of a retrofit kit with electrification components? So, and the clear target was to have still the same power, the same performance, but with the zero emissions. You brought to this party an existing power pack. How did you, did you have to modify that power pack for this particular application? Yes, it's really customized. So we are using our existing products like our global vehicle motor, the GVM 310. We have a mobile inverter inside. We have a customized battery package, a charger, we have coolers. So this is are the main components we need to change to replace the diesel engine, but still having the same power and same performance as the conventional. What were the key challenges of, of the conversion? I guess doing it in a very short space of time was one of those. Yes, the target was with we have a short time frame, so the target was also to keep most of the components so that you don't have to change the whole machine. So uh, that was one of the challenges, but in the end uh, we could make it with the components I mentioned already we changed for uh, replacing the diesel engine. And what implications has, had, has this had further down the drivetrain? Does it impact on the rest of the drivetrain now we're going from electric or from diesel to electric? Well, we are, we are trying to keep most of the things. So you have still uh, the, uh, the gearbox, you still have all the hydraulics, it's still the same. But you replace the diesel engine uh, with the electric motor. We could also replace one pump because the one pump was also needed for cooling. So it was need, not needed anymore because the new coolers we integrated here are working uh, electrically. Obviously, this is a machine that is now for sale as a, a complete machine. But is, would it be possible to retrofit this to an existing L120 diesel machine that's in the field? Yeah, that's that's the target, that we have a retrofit electrification kit ready so that you can also retrofit existing machines.